just beautiful photograph of them today. It is a remarkable they look achievement. Amazing, and congratulations they? to everybody, every yeah. couple that's done 70 years. I think it's fantastic. It is an amazing achievement. But I understand the weather that day wasn't quite so good. Was it not? It was, well, it was a lot like today, actually, funnily <laughs> Wet, enough. Really? Yes, I've dug out the uh, the weather map from the day, 70 years ago today, so I thought we can have a quick look at it. Uh, this is the Met Office map, obviously, and we've got uh, a warm front there trailing through the country, much as we had a bit earlier on today. The isobars there quite tightly packed together, as indeed they have been for today. And you can see the little, um, little sort of bits and pieces of information there. They're known as station circles. And we still use a similar format today, actually. And that tells me that it was cloudy, the cloud was quite low, the visibility wasn't very good, and there was a little bit of drizzle as well. So um, not a great deal of change there. And we still use those weather maps today, but we don't draw them up by hand anymore. You still use the same weather maps? Very similar, yes, as in we still draw it up like that, but just obviously it's done by a computer nowadays. So nothing has changed in 70 years then, weather-wise? Well, I like to think we've got a bit better in terms of the well, forecasting. Michael Fish is still doing the forecast. Well, <laughs> <laughs> but in terms of the weather itself, no, nothing changes. Yeah. And this rather miserable weather we've got at the moment, is it going to buck up, please? Not for tomorrow, no, sorry. Or indeed Wednesday. Wednesday might be a bit better, but, um, but later in the day it turns very wet. So, yeah, I haven't got much for you, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll take whatever you've got, because here is your full forecast. Holly Green. Great Western Railway sponsors the ITV Meridian Weather. So not the most inspiring start to our week. We've had pretty cloudy skies. It's been a bit damp in places. But some nice photos coming in. Thanks to Judy for this one of Studland Bay. Now, over the coming days, we do tend to keep a lot of that cloud. There will be some further spells of rain. But actually, the bulk of the rain comes through overnight. Quite a brisk wind around as well, especially towards Wednesday. That wind becoming quite strong. But we do stay mild. And that's because we're on the mild side of the jet stream. But that jet stream bringing us some spells of rain as well. So a bit of rain for tonight, a bit of rain for tomorrow night. But more notably, this feature comes in for Wednesday night, and this could bring some pretty lively rain, and the winds really whip up ahead of it as well. Now through tonight, we have got fairly cloudy skies. It tends to sink down a bit as well, so a bit of mistiness across the hills. Some outbreaks of rain come and go at times through the night, although I think in general not too much of it. And it does stay mild, with temperatures in double figures as we head into tomorrow, thanks to that cloud and the wind. So a mild start tomorrow, but again, quite a grey start to things. Now, you might see a few bright spells for tomorrow, perhaps a slightly better chance than today. But in general, I think for most of us, quite grey. We have got that brisk wind around, especially into coastal areas. And it is mild, a few spots of rain, but I think the bulk of the day is dry until overnight. These are our times of high water. Pool at 10.04 in the morning and 10.36 in the evening. So we see some further rain moving in on Tuesday night. For Wednesday, perhaps much of the day is dry, but it will be quite windy. And into the evening and overnight, we do see some pretty lively rain moving in. After that, more of a showery picture, I think, to end the week, but with temperatures taking quite a tumble for Friday and the weekend. Have a good evening. Great Western Railway sponsors the ITV Meridian Weather. Now, in just a moment, the ITV Evening News tonight with Mary Nightingale. Stacey's got our late news. I'm looking forward to it, aren't you? Even later than usual tonight. <laughs> <laughs> still looking forward to it. But for now, from the team here at ITV Meridian, thanks for watching. Take care from all of us. Bye-bye. Good night. <laughs>